Moving now to a crucial new clue and a frightening encounter near an Orange County school. Deputies say the man in this surveillance video, you see that white spot moving across your screen, tried to grab a middle school student and more than a week later, he still hasn't been caught. Sashal Saunders is live along Karina Drive and Sattel Drive, not far from Lockhart Middle School. And Sashal, the victim says she was walking to the bus stop when the man approached her. Yeah, Kirsten, you'd have to think this is a middle school student. She had on a backpack. She was walking around at bus stop time, so he had to have seen that this was a child. Well, that did not deter him, and so police want to find him. They're hoping that someone recognizes him in this video. I want to take the time to remind parents to talk to your child about stranger danger in any situation. Calls sent out to parents at Lockhart Middle School with a warning after deputies say the man you see in this video tried kidnapping a 14 year old girl. He walked slowly around the Edgewater neighborhood, stopping at points. We want to catch him and arrest him. That girl told officers at school she was walking to the bus at Karina and Sattel Drive when the man grabbed her by her bag, saying, come here. She jerked her arm and said, stop. And that's when he reportedly said, why are you scared? This could be fun. The girl was able to get away, but that doesn't calm neighbors who want him found. I hope they catch him and he needs to stop that because he's a grown man. And as you can see, uh, there's a school sign. There are a lot of kids in this neighborhood. That's what they tell us. Uh, if you recognize the man, there's just a small description. It's a white man. He's no more than about uh, 30 years old, uh, or no more than about six feet, I'm sorry, and about 30 to 40 years old. He would have been walking around the neighborhood last week. You can call Crime Line or you can call Orange County deputies. We're now reporting live in Orange County. Sashel Saunders, News 6.